The World Health Organization estimates that by increasing tobacco taxes by 50%, all countries would reduce the number of smokers by 49 million within the next three years and ultimately save 11 million lives. This is the WHO's view, but do smokers feel the same way? Um, they've done this before, and I don't think it's really curbed, curbed smoking or stopped people from smoking. I don't think the local laws will either. I think if you really want people to stop smoking, you've got to ban the import of cigarettes. Um, the other thing that it'll do is we'll have more black market cigarettes um, and uh, more fake imposters. So no, I don't, I don't think it's a good solution at all. World No Tobacco Day is commemorated worldwide on the 31st of May annually. The World Health Organization calls on all countries to raise taxes on tobacco to discourage users from smoking and prevent addiction to tobacco products. According to statistics by the WHO, tobacco kills nearly 6 million people every year, of which 600,000 are non-smokers who die from breathing second-hand smoke. Smoking is a health risk, but ultimately it is about personal choice. If you want to stop smoking, you will. Increasing taxes won't stop a smoker from smoking. In the meantime, British American Tobacco stood up against the proposal by the World Health Organization, saying that this is not the answer. Instead, they caution against the unintended consequences, believing that this could have drastic effects on the economies of the countries affected. British American Tobacco further believes that increased taxes on cigarettes will only force smokers to purchase cheaper cigarette brands, which are often illicit brands that have severe economic and social impact. As this work for alcohol, what are they going to do with the extra tax money? Will they use it for cancer treatment or things like that? Yes, if they do that, then it makes sense to me. But I don't think increasing tax on cigarettes will encourage people to stop smoking. At the moment, offenders are already being apprehended for smoking in public, but the full and strict implementation of the law will come into effect in July. Franjo Olafir reporting for the news on one.